This video describes new enhancements to thread milling cycles, now available in Esprit. Like drilling operations, thread milling cycles in Esprit now support multiple orientations using a single hole feature. This avoids collisions in the linking movements between holes, adopting the same linking technology as used in the drilling strategies. This part has two thread milling operations on two separate hole features. The first hole feature includes three M20 by 2.0 threaded holes with different orientations. The next hole feature is a single M36 by 2.0 threaded hole at an entirely different orientation. To apply a thread milling operation, select the hole feature, go to the milling tab on the ribbon, and click Threading. Taking a closer look at the toolpath of the M22 by 2.5 threaded hole operation, Note that the link applied for the transition between orientations is the same as the one applied in a drilling cycle. Now if we look at the toolpath of this thread mill operation, note that the lead in out type is set to radially. In this case, we want to reduce the feed rate of our tool engagement. We edit the thread operation, go to the links tab, and set the default entry feed rate from 100% to 30%. In simulation, note that the feed rate drops from 343 per minute to 103 per minute as the tool enters the hole. There is also a new option for transition move available in the strategy tab. In cases where residual chips from other operations have accumulated at the bottom of the hole, this transition move parameter controls axial movement from the clearance plane to the depth in addition to movements between passes. Three types of transition moves are available, rapid, feed, and feed at depth. First, we leave transition move set to rapid. In simulation, note that we do not have any specific motion in simulation status, which means that the motion is rapid. The rapid transition move corresponds to the existing behavior, which means that the tool rapids down from the clearance above the hole to the hole's depth. Now we edit the operation and change the transition move to feed at depth. In simulation, Note that there is still no indication for the motion when the tool goes down the hole. This time the motion is rapid from the clearance above the hole to the clearance above the hole's depth. The tool then feeds down from the clearance above the hole's depth to its depth before it starts to lead in and cut. We edit the operation a final time and change the transition move to feed. In simulation, note that the motion shows feed in the simulation status manager. The feed transition move lets the tool feed down from the hole's clearance to the hole's depth. Let's take a closer look at the other hole feature. Note that the lead-in out type is a tangential arc and its start angle is at 90 degrees. You can now reduce the lead-in out start angle to reduce the cycle time or when there is not enough room to generate a full 90 degree arc. You can also increase this lead in out start angle in case of a small hole diameter where the tool engagement could be too fast and cause high strain. We would like to minimize the tool path here. On the links tab, set the lead in out start angle of the tangential arc to 45. Validate and note the new tool path. Finally, similar to the other two and a half axis milling strategies, you can now set a starting depth value to avoid burrs or partial threads at the start of the hole. To do this, edit the operation, go to the strategy tab, and set a negative starting depth value to cut above the selected feature. We set the starting depth to minus two. To summarize, you can now thread holes with the same shapes on different planes and different orientations while avoiding collisions and leaking movements between holes. With thread milling cycle, you can control your tool engagement feed rate, your tool's axial movement with the new transition move parameter, the start angle of the tangential arc lead in and lead out, and the starting depth of your operation. Thank you for watching this Esprit product feature video. For more information about this and other new features in Esprit, refer to the release bulletin and product help.